Dreams without plans are just wishes. Have you even thought about why you want that big internship? I believe that if you want something in life, you need to set a goal. Goals are most effective when they mean something to you and they have a deadline. My goal for the summer of 2015 was to get an internship with a company at the caliber of Google for summer 2016, which meant I had to be ready by fall 2015 because that's how early these big companies recruit. The worst is when you're doing something and you don't know why you're doing it. After you have your goal, you need to know why you want it really badly. If you can't answer this question, then this isn't a really good goal for you. If you try to work towards a goal that you half-heartedly want, you're only going to get half-hearted results. When the going gets hard, you won't have the drive to push you to keep going. But wanting an internship at a big company is a good goal, and I'm going to tell you why this might be something that you want. Let's first be honest. Software engineering interns get paid very well. Within big companies, the lower end <coughs> Google pay around $35 an hour, and the higher end pay almost $50 an hour. Don't do it just for the money though, because the other things are even more valuable. Internships allow you to try out different companies, much like dating. There's no commitment, and good companies don't just make you a cheap short-term hire, but actually implement programs to help you learn and grow. Through my internships, I've been able to meet smart, driven, and like-minded people. Hearing their stories and what they've done have both been inspiring and humbling. At the companies I've interned at, I've also had the most patient and brilliant managers and mentors. They were there to make sure I never felt lost and that I was in the best environment to learn and grow as a developer. Most software engineering companies treat their interns as if they were full-time. What this means is that you'll have more responsibility, but that also gives you more chance to make impact. Your work, depending on your project, can impact thousands if not millions of people. When it comes to internship specific events, these companies sure know how to spoil us. From Segway tours to getting paid to go to Disneyland to escape rooms, these companies know how to spoil us and make sure we're having a good time. Where'd the ball go? Separate video idea. And finally, the most, most, most valuable thing you can get from these internships is friends that are as like-minded and hardworking as you. The past year, I've had the most amazing friends, ones that I've kept in touch with till today. These are friends that you can go on hikes with, share ideas with, and grow together with. They'll also be able to refer you to the awesome companies and internet in the future. Hopefully by now you can see why an internship at a big company is worth striving for. Okay, so if what I just said interests you, then let's set our goal to be, I want to get a big internship at Google. If that doesn't interest you, then thanks for watching, I guess. Anyway, goals change, so this doesn't have to be your final goal, and you don't have to be disappointed if you don't get it. But when you're trying to achieve something big, it's great to have a sense of direction, and trying to get a big internship at a company like Google is a really good starting direction. There's this saying, isn't there a saying that says, if you aim for the stars... Isn't there a saying like, if there's a mountain and you aim for the peak of the mountain, the highest you can go is the mountain, but if you shoot for the moon, they might not hit the moon, but you'll land among the stars. Shoot for the moon, land among the stars, something like that. But my point is that even if you don't, even if you aim for Google, but you don't get Google, your skill set would probably be so good that another big company might still want you. For example, for me, in fall 2015, uh, my goal was also to get an internship at Google. But although I didn't get it, I got an internship at Hulu and Yelp. And, uh, and while I was interning at Hulu, I got another chance to interview with Google, and only then I got Google. So um, even though you don't reach this specific goal, you'll probably be at the level where you can also achieve something similar. Now I'm going to bring you back to reality for a bit. Goals and dreams are just mere fantasies, unless you want the struggle and the journey that comes with it. So I read a really good article on this by Mark Manson, so I'll include a link in the description. So what is, what is the struggle? What is the journey? Um, later videos will detail what specifically to do in terms of the computer programming stuff and the interview stuff. But another struggle is effectively managing your time. You're most likely in a position where on top of school, you also have other priorities such as doing side projects, preparing for interviews, hanging out with friends, other student orgs, um, etc. And to be honest, if your current lifestyle isn't getting you to where you want to go, you need to change it so that you can get to where you want to go. I'm not saying it has to be like a complete shift, but it definitely might mean that you have to change your habits or even what you think about from day to day. This might mean cutting back on games, watching less anime, 
or even spending a little less time with your friends. You have to think in the big picture though. Sacrifices today can pay you back tenfold in the future. Don't be scared of the struggle and the journey. Be excited. Enjoy and relish in the fact that you're challenging yourself and taking control of your life. When it comes to staying motivated, there will be times when you will feel burnt out. That's normal. At times like these, ask yourself why you're doing this. This is why you have to intrinsically want that big internship. If you deep down truly want it, then you will find that motivation. Know that in the end, it will be worth it. Alright, and that wraps up this video. To recap, goals are very important. I went over the reasons why I think you should want a big internship. I also briefly went over the struggle and the journey that comes along with trying to get a big internship. I wasn't trying to discourage you, but I just wanted to show you that this is something that you should seriously consider. Because there will be times when it won't be easy, and you'll need to look back at your reasons and ask yourself why you're doing this. After watching the rest of the videos, I think it would be beneficial if you come back to this video and rewatch it. You should then do some self-reflecting and ask yourself that this is something you want and something that you want to commit yourself to. Through my internships, I've been able to meet. Through my internships, I've been able to. <laughs> through my internships, I've been able to meet smart. Through my internships, I've been able to meet smart, driven, and like-minded people. Um, Fifteen was to get an internship at a big company. Um, my goal for my goal. Later details will detail. Oops, I wasn't trying to. I wasn't trying to discourage you, only to show I was at most big software engineering companies, um, hearing their stories and what they've done have both been hearing their stories and what they've done has been both humbling and inspiring.